The police in St. Catherine have now identified the licensed firearm holder who was shot dead at a cockfight in bushes in Old Arbor on Sunday. He is 56-year-old Devon Gallimore of Davis District in Old Arbor and New Bowen in Clarendon. The police say his weapon has still not been located. It is reported that Gallimore was at the event when he received a phone call and moved away from the crowd. Explosions were subsequently heard. Checks revealed that he was shot in the head and was seen lying on his back. St. James Police have arrested a man and his girlfriend for the murder of a man in the parish on Sunday night. The body of the victim was found with the head bashed in near the UDC football field about 11.30 p.m. It is alleged that the victim had been engaging in sexual intercourse with the couple when he was killed. The woman and her boyfriend were chased and held by the police after they were seen running from the location. Investigators say the location where the body was discovered is a heavily vegetated area commonly used by homeless people for dwelling and for people involved in prostitution as a place for sexual activity. Two large stones believed to have been used to commit the violent attack were found at the scene. The suspects are being questioned. The two men who died in a multi-vehicle crash in Discovery Basin and on Friday have been identified. Dead are 23-year-old Jamar Purdue of Barrett Town Little River in St. James and a 27-year-old plumber, Jamie Anthony Johnson of Daniel Town, Trelawney. According to the police, around 3.35 p.m., a Higher motor truck was traveling westerly towards Discovery Bay when it is alleged that a BMW motor car which was traveling easterly towards Renova Bay attempted to overtake a Toyota Mark X and collided with the Higher motor truck. The Higher motor truck then veered off the road and became lodged in a mangrove. It is reported that a Toyota Mark X motor car then collided with the rear of a Toyota Tundra motor truck which also traveled easterly. Lawmen say the Toyota Tundra, the Toyota Mark X and the BMW motor car all veered off the road and were lodged together and then caught fire. Purdue and Johnson were burned to death while several other people were injured, who were injured were taken to hospital for treatment.